There was another uh, piece out of, uh, oh, out of Pittsburgh. Okay. So last Friday, three days ago, a police union president, and I don't know if it's like New York, there's multiple police unions in this city, but a police union president sent an email to Pittsburgh's chief of police writing, among other things, your actions raise serious concerns. Enough is enough. Another cop says the chief is calling us racists. He believes the Pittsburgh Police Department is racist. This has angered a lot of officers. What did this police chief do? He was photographed with a sign. Apparently he had, um, well, here's what the sign said. This is very controversial, folks. I resolved to challenge racism at work. And hashtag end white silence. Whoa! Hold up! <laughs> <laughs> what are you trying? What are you trying? I can't even keep a straight. <laughs> that is the most offensive thing I've ever heard in my life. <laughs> Why don't you just slap me across the face? So he wrote a great response to this uh, police union, which was basically a, I'm really sorry that you're such a douchebag. <laughs> but it goes like this. It, uh, he writes, uh, to the Bureau of Police, it appears my having been photographed with the sign supporting racial justice at work and, end quote, white silence has offended some. If any of my Pittsburgh um, PBP... I guess that's the uh, Pittsburgh, uh, you know, police Pittsburgh benevolent police, benevolence, police whatever, the, the folks at the union. Family was offended. I apologize. You're very important to me, and I would never hurt you purposefully. <laughs> <laughs> Let me explain the backstory. And he goes and he talks about how he went to a coffee shop and ran into uh, a group of people who, uh, of all races, uh, who were talking about racial inequality and injustice. They asked me to take a picture holding a sign. The sign indicated my willingness to challenge racial problems in the workplace. I am so committed. If there's problems with the PBP related to racial injustice, I will take action to fix them. To me, the term, quote, white silence simply means that we must be willing to speak up to address issues of racial injustice, poverty, etc. In my heart, I believe we all must come together as a community to address real world problems, and I'm willing to be a voice to bring that community together. Whoa! <laughs> Why are you offending me? He says, I saw no indictment of police or anyone else in the sign. Remember, he just dropped in at a coffee shop. People were just talking about, in general, racial injustice. You know, folks, this may come as a uh, late-breaking news story, but there's still some problems with race in this country. Yeah, tell me about it. It's called reverse racism. <laughs> What the I guy do holds a up a sign that says, I resolve to challenge racism at work and to end white silence. And the police union immediately goes like, are you talking about us? Some guy goes like, no, no, he's talking about what white officers have to deal with. <laughs> Cut the chief a break. He goes he's on, talking he says, about us. But I do apologize to any of you who felt I was not supporting you. That was not my intent. The reality of U.S. policing is that our enforcement efforts have a disparate impact on the communities of color. This is a statistical fact. You know, as well as I, the social factors driving this reality. In other words, I'm really sorry if I offended you. But let's face it, there, there's a problem that you guys have. And uh, I support your efforts to keep our community safe and will back your best efforts to do so. I, tr I trust and have faith in you. I also support efforts to improve and restore the community's perception of justice. In other words, uh, let's get serious here, guys. Grow up. For future reference, <laughs> having a massive meltdown 
about you pointing about it. It's just like right. when you hear racism mentioned that you immediately think that someone's talking about you. That's right. not a great look, guys. In the future, if I come out and say I am against racism, you should not stand up and go, hey, why are you criticizing us? <laughs> For future reference, you might say, we agree with the chief. Wonder who he's talking about. Racism hmm, is interesting bad. Interesting point. We would never, we would <laughs> never, ever allow for racism on our watch. It's really, like, literally protecting, like, whoa, whoa, whoa. It was one thing where you started to uh, talk about taking away our pension, but don't take away our racism. <laughs> He should do a do's and don'ts video. <laughs> do. <laughs> Mildly condemn racism. Don't. Yeah. Have a breakdown with the chief condemns racism. <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs>